Well, this, this week on my bowl video, I'm, or next week rather, I'm going to transition a little bit to a, a vase. That's the plan if the material comes in. It should be in in time. But in light of that, I'm going to do this little project. I've been doing these little Steve Good patterns. Uh, usually on a Thursday or Friday after I get my video posted, and that's in the... Uh, my bow video is, is being posted as I speak. It's uploading. So I found this little vase that Steve Good has. He has two books of vases, very nice vases. And I recommend looking at them if you haven't seen them. I have about any of the books. I'm thinking about buying one or both of them. And uh, it's not, not hard to transition from bowls to vases because in some instances a, a vase is inverted bowls. But in this case, it's a three-piece vase. So I dug through, it's a very small one. I dug through my scraps and I had this piece of purple heart. And it was just exactly the width for this body of this base. Of this base. Uh, I may regret using that. It's difficult to cut. It's difficult to glue sometimes. But I'm gonna try it just to use it up for no other reason. And then I have some oddball material. This is actually 7 sixteenths. He says use one quarter inch. But I think this will be a good contrast with the uh, purple heart. And that's the reason I, plus it's a small piece and try not to cut up my big pieces if I can help it, especially for a small project like this. I'm going to go to a seven or a nine blade, cut this out and cut it very carefully and slowly. And then I'll get over to a number three probably to cut these. I've got a little bit of fret work there. And then glue them together and match them up. And uh, probably do some routering or at least some sanding on the edges. Uh, see how, I've, you know, a Purple Heart may be difficult to router. I'm not sure. But uh, it'd be difficult to sand too. But anyway, that's what I've got. I thought I'd use it. And uh, let me get over to the saw. I'm going to cut this first. And if it gives me problems, I may switch to something else. I've got lots of three-quarter inch stock. But this is a small piece. I don't know what else I use it for right now. So I'm going to get over there and cut that first. And then I'll see how that works.
Okay, so there's the finished little vase. Steve Good calls that a mini vase, I believe. Anyway, it's a neat little vase. Quick and easy. Nice to, nice to make. I routered that just really lightly, not a lot. Real light routering, and then I sanded it also. Of course, I had to sand everything to match. It was matching pretty good, but I had to get a little rip, a few ripples out of it and match those sides up a little bit. Uh, I think that Purple Heart turned out very nice with that. It's a good contrast. So if you like that, hit the like button. Now I'm going to start a playlist with bases, I think. I'm going to try to do one next week, and this will be the first entry in it. Just a short, quick little video for the end of the week. I hope you enjoyed that. If you do, hit the like button. If you want to see more of this kind of thing, well, hit the subscribe button. And I hope to see you in the next one.